What's up guys? It's Sarah with Fishman. Uh, today I want to talk about a feature within the Triple Play software that I think is often overlooked. If you are a live performer and you're using this software, this is an invaluable feature. So let's take a look at it. All right, the first thing you're going to want to do is open up your patches window and make sure you have a pretty good amount of user patches. These would be your favorites that you're probably going to use live um, that you might even use in multiple songs. So once you have those, go to Window, Songs. You'll notice that the font is really big so that you can see it if you're, you know, across the stage or something. So you notice you got your user patches right here. And then you got your list of songs. Now I like to think of this as a set list. Um, so, for instance, I have New Song 1. And then I've got Crazy Water, just a random name. You'll notice that these are blue. Sometimes I'm sure you guys have noticed that when you load a regular patch, um, some of them are bigger than others and they take a couple seconds. That is not going to fly when you're playing live and you need to quickly change. So what we've created here is a way to cache those presets or patches as we call them. So you see that they're blue, that means that they're cached. So now my song, current song, Crazy Water, those patches are going to load a heck of a lot faster. So you just move through them and you'll see that it's moving really quickly. Normally these would take a little time to to load but they're moving far faster okay because they're cached. So let's say I have a set I'm playing I don't know 10 songs. Um, you can create create a song here calling it whatever. Um, and then you drag whatever user patch that you want to use in that song. And it'll take a second and then you'll notice it here. It'll, uh, it'll cache. See? Turns blue. So create your, your set list for, you know, whatever songs you're going to do and whatever order you want them in. You can repeat. You can repeat different patches. And then you'll have a whole set that'll move much, much faster that you can use, um, you know, anytime live or if you're playing at home. Um, it's just a, a great feature to, to be able to move through them a lot faster using the D-pad or the up and down pad on your Triple Play Connect or wireless. Be sure to like and follow. And if you have any more questions, please put them in the comments below and I'll do my best to make you a tutorial. Thanks a lot.